Y'all know what really chaps my ass is an entitled white person. Because what I don't understand is that y'all have no tears, no remorse, no understanding, no recollection on where y'all could have went wrong in the in the storyline of what it is that y'all have done up until y'all get proved guilty. Because why you didn't have no compassion or no tears in trying to figure out what was wrong with that man? How you gonna sit up there and automatically say that the man was drunk when you don't have no breathalyzer in sight. I, I just don't understand that. How do you make a determination when you don't have the authority to do so? Make it make sense to me. It's almost to the point to where it don't matter what y'all have on, whether it's plain clothes or a uniform, African Americans should be on alert because y'all feel like just because of what y'all, the skin y'all was born in, y'all are automatically put in an authoritative position over us. And I don't know who needs to tell y'all, but baby, that's false. And it ain't never going to happen. Not over here, not over there, not anywhere. You, I, It don't matter. You purposely not listen to the dispatcher when she tells you not to follow and not to pursue because you feel like you need to put on your racist cape and go save the day. Then you continue to say, oh, he shot himself with my gun, this, that, and the third. No, you shot him. Because had you mind the business that paid you and stayed where you was, you wouldn't have even been there. You wouldn't have even been put in a situation to where you had to be in any type of struggle. Because you created the struggle. You created the situation. You created a hostile situation. Because you didn't want to mind your business. Because you felt like, because it was an African American person who you deemed under the influence, you felt like it was your responsibility to save him from the streets of America. Get you a life. Like, I really be thinking that people that insert themselves that much don't have nothing else to do with their time but involve themselves in other people's business. Don't you got a man? Don't you got your own family? Don't you have your own job that you should have been more concerned with once them people told you that they had it? Or take a picture of the license plate and call it in like everybody else. But to take this man life when all he was trying to do was go get help, you hindered him from getting the help that he was leaving out of his house to go get. The man was disoriented, and instead of you thinking any of the other things that could have been wrong with him, he just had to be drunk and was an issue. I don't know what it is about brown or black skin that make y'all think that the only thing we can be is negative. There has to be something negative going on. We have to be irate. We have to be angry. We have to be drunk. We have to be high. But y'all don't have to do anything but be white, right? We tired of it. And I don't know who needs to hear this, but baby, we are not our ancestors. This is Mary and uh, Harriet 4.0. You want some, come get some. You do something, I'm going to make sure you pay for it. Because this is not the old days. You don't do what you want to do and think that it's fine. You're going to do what you want to do and end up messing around and finding out. Because I'm going to come at you just like you come at me. And I am so sorry that there was nobody around to be there for that man. And I am so sorry. And I send my condolences out to that man family and friends because he did not deserve that it was uncalled for and it is a sad day when you trying to go get help for yourself but you get hindered from somebody else just because the color of your skin and because they feel like they're in a position to be something that they're not the power trip of you no book paper colored people is getting a little bit too much and i don't know who this lady is with her hand over her mouth but she getting on my nerves I don't know who she is, but put your hand down. Because you look like you'll do something stupid like that too. I don't know y'all all on my nerves.